Uh, Bob Zemeckis, Steve Carell, what can you tell us uh, about Mr. Hogan Camp and what drew you to him? What makes him interesting to you? Well, um, I, I learned about him through stumbling onto the documentary. And um, I thought his story was incredibly compelling. I thought it was a very heroic story and a very uh, moving, heartwarming, hopeful story. I saw it, I couldn't get out of my head. I, I couldn't get the idea of what this man went through out of my head and it, it was inspiring. And uh, really, I, I just wanted to, to, <laughs> to hug the whole idea of it. You know, I just, I, I know that sounds so cliche, but um, it made me feel good. Uh, I, I, it, it gave me hope because it's a guy who went through a terrible thing but didn't become bitter and didn't become cynical. And uh, his, his kindness uh, is pervasive. As an actor, do you have to switch your mental frame to going from real Mark Camp to doll to action figure Hogenkamp? Um, as, well, as opposed to shifting or changing my mental frame, it was more like um, extending his personality into another person, if that, if that makes sense. Because he's an alter ego. The, the part that I play as, as Hoagie which is Mark Hogan Camp's alter ego. Uh, he's just all of the best parts of Mark, or the parts that Mark aspires to be. And so I just tried to think about, like in my own mind, like what, what would be the best parts of me? What would I want to kind of achieve in the world uh, personality-wise, like to be more confident or to be uh, more decisive or like all of the all of the things that you feel like might be shortcomings in your own life that's I tried to kind of transpose into this other guy and build this swaggering GI character. Bob it has a lot of visual magic in it as most of your films do um, but there's also some uh, some pretty serious stuff this is sort of a war movie in a way and there's also some pretty risque mm -hmm. stuff there are some mm -hmm. scantily clad dolls in this movie. I'm wondering how you mix the, the whimsy with some of those more perhaps risque and um, grown-up elements. The, the movie is sort of a mix of uh, a lot of different genres. Um, you know, the thing that happened to Mark is a serious thing that happened, um, but that didn't mean that there couldn't be comedy and there couldn't be whimsy in the movie, and there couldn't be some action. He, he creates those dolls in the way that he can using these fashion, fashion dolls to do it and uh, you know, you know th that's sort of an extension. The way I always looked at it, there was sort of an extension of his his um, love of them and his honoring them. Bob Zemeckis, Steve Carell, thanks so much for joining us. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it.